Hello and welcome back. In this video we'll talk about taking a power of a product. First simple example, let's suppose we have a product, let's use uh, 5x to the, let's call it the fourth power. That's a product. Now if we take that entire product and we raise it to the, let's say the third power, and we want to show this in expand form. We can do a form of distribution. As long as I have a product inside, I can take this three on the outside and distribute it. So I can rewrite this as five to the third power times x to the fourth raised to the third. So you can see I took this three and I put it here and I put it here. And then we can actually evaluate. Sometimes this number out here is just too big and we just leave it as the exponent. But five to the third power is really not too big. So five to the third power evaluates out to 125. Now using the rules previously, x to the fourth raised to the third, I'm going to call that x to the four times three, which of course is going to give us x to the twelfth power. So this entire expression right here, five x to the fourth raised to the third, simply evaluates out to 125 x to the twelfth. We can try this again if we had multiple uh, variables inside, multiple products. Let's suppose I have a two a squared b to the fourth and I want to raise this whole thing to the uh, let's call it the fifth power. We can do it in long form or we can just distribute this five to each one of these. Now this this is going to be a two raised to the fifth power. Two to the fifth power is going to be two times two times two times two times two times two and I did this in my head so these are going to give me four actually I got too many twos there. This is going to give me 4, and I just bring down a 2. So I multiplied across here, I got 16, and 16 times 2 gives us 32. So you can actually multiply your exponents in your head that way. So I get 32, and then I've got an a. a to the second on the inside raised to the fifth is going to be 2 times 5, which is going to give us 10th power, 32 a to the 10th. And we do the same thing with the b. b to the fourth raised to the fifth is going to give us b to the 4 times 5, which is b to the 20th. And that's really a short way of handling uh, power of a product.